Hey guys, Cross here. We've got a quick video guide to um, locating a little gravel patch that can be found on Foundry Dock. Now, I think most of you are obviously know that it's all silt across the bottom, but um, thanks to one of my subs, he's disclosed um, a nice little gravel patch that helped me straight away last night to uh, to catch one of the boss bream slimer so without further ado let's jump in and set it up so i'm gonna i'll just give you a quick look at the tackle box that i'm using i'm using 15 pound su braid on all three rods along with the um, sonic tonos 10,000s. rigs wise i'm gonna be using the um, size 4 and size 6 rigs I'm going to actually change one of these to a gravel rig. So I'll change this one here to a size 6 gravel. We've got a size 4 and we'll change that one to a size 6 KD. So we've got size 4, size 6 KDs size 4 size 6 df for gravel bait wise um, 18 mil sinking boiler activate boiler 18 mil floating dumbbell and two 20 mil tiger nuts one sinking one pop up so let's go to game modes and we're gonna go on we'll just go on single player freedom fishing foundry dock stick it on 24 hours Leave it on long, tackle box, everything else is standard. And play. Now, you're going to find this, you need to spawn in at this teleport location, which is here. You'll find you'll spawn in just in front of the hotel with the blue neon, neon sign. So, walk along to the peg just in front of the. Um, the hotel and we'll claim that peg now what you want to do is you want to look towards the crane on the opposite side and then cast out in that direction and you're not doing a big cast you only want to go say say 50% of the power bar And then if you retrieve the bait back and you want to come back to about 30 I think it's about 36 yards out so it goes really slowly if you want to if you hold down your fast walk button fast walk button also enables slow retrieve and the 35 yards out and we're on we're on the money so we're gonna leave that there and see what happens I haven't changed any rigs We'll just see what happens and then um, we will then change up to the gravel rig and see if that makes a difference so I'm just gonna fish with the one rod and uh, let's wait and see what bites now the winds blowing over this direction anyway so hopefully it shouldn't take too long before we get something uh, something on the bait now, like, as, as I said before, it's pretty much silt everywhere on this lake. So, finding a little feature like this is uh, is really good. Now, I'm going to put a, a link in the description to Jason, who gave me the tip last night, to his Mixer um, profile. So, if you give him a follow on Mixer, he'd much appreciate it. Um, I think he comes. I think his name on uh, on mixer is Lemon Haze. But um, I'll stick his I'll stick his name in the description. So I'll look down below. We just gotta wait now, as per usual. See what happens. It is a very very small gravel patch, so. Um, 
without being shown it would have took me a while to actually find it and here we go we've got a run oh, and the fish got off right so that tells me we are actually using the gravel rig size 4 I'm gonna to change to a size I've got two size 4 gravel rigs should have had a size 6 so let's just go to the, uh, the quick edit Get behind these, uh, behind these rods. And same again. Let's set the rig up this time. So we want a size six, and I'm actually going to use the 18 mil sinking uh, activate boiler. Same again. About 50%. Doesn't matter if it's a little bit more. Cast it out. Hold your uh, fast walk button down, and it should let you retrieve it a little bit slowly. Just go easy on it because it is a very small gravel patch, as you saw. Then, I'd, as soon as I hit it, I was off it. So let's try again. a very delicate job retrieving it so that it actually doesn't go past it oh, off it again once more we're on it right we're set this time I'm not really sure if the uh, the actual rig between a silt and a gravel rig make that much of a difference because I'm sure I had the one the, the Slimer uh, boss bream last night on using a silt rig so if nothing happens, we'll switch to silt and see if that, that draws one in. Here we go. Fish on. So what fish is it going to be? trying to get off whatever it is Just trying to get off again hitting the limiter It's in the net. What have we got? So we've got a nice little leather. And that's off the gravel patch. Right, this time I'm going to switch to size 4 KD. And a tiger nut. We're going to fish the exact same spot. So 
once again holding quick walk button down and we're on our gravel 35 yards out and let's see if that that rig change from a gravel rig to a silt rig and the bait change from the boiler to the tiger nut makes a difference we go and it seems to have been picked up sooner this time this time the fish is actually taking line it's swimming away from us So actually fishing on the gravel with a silt rig doesn't really make a difference. You know, they're, they're still picking it up. In fact, it picked it up sooner. So... Got one final test after this one. We'll do one last cast, which will be using this silt rig, but with the 18mm boiler that I was using on the um, on the gravel rig. Or actually, I could do two more casts: one with the 18mm boiler on the grav on the silt rig, and one with the 20mm tiger nut on the gravel rig. Let's see which one works works the best has the best result I think this is definitely a better fish than the last one see though yeah much bigger fish another common mr. perfect there we go so we've just had our uh, a boss fish pretty much straight away second fish has been a boss off that gravel gravel bar gravel uh, patch it's not really a bar it's more of a patch um, that puts me second on my leaderboard and we'll let him go so that was caught using a size 4 KD with a size 20 tiger nut pop up so let's try one more uh, two more two more casts we'll try the 18 mil on the same rig 18 mil activate sinker same spot again delicately and we're off it We've gone too far Again. So let's see what happens now. Here we go. 
Fish on. Now this time it's not it's not taking line. It's come pretty much straight in. It's in the net. It's not very big. And we've got a tench this time. So the fish meal float type boilie um, seems to attract the other species. Let's chuck that one back. And then we'll do one last cast, but this time using the gravel rig. We'll go with the size four gravel rig and the 20 mil tiger nut pop up. So it just goes to show that you don't really need to use the the gravel rig on gravel to hit the big fish. As Mr. Perfect just proved, we use the size 4 KD silt over the gravel with a size 20 pop-up tiger nut and we got our boss. So we just give this one a couple more minutes to see, see if it, anything happens. And it doesn't look like there's nothing major happening. Not really quick. Not responsive enough. So I'm gonna I'm gonna close it there. Let's pick up the rod. So yeah, best setup. If you want to go, I was using that with that. So KD size four. 20 mil tiger nut on the gravel Bob's your uncle Mr. Perfect was in the net second fish I'm going to recast back on that spot and that's where I'm going to leave you there, guys. All right, thanks for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe if you want to see more fish fishing videos from Euro Fishing from me, Crossy. Take care. See you soon.